what volume in milliliters of a 0.154 molar magnesium acetate, this is the formula for magnesium acetate, is required to make a solution with a specific concentration of acetate ion. First, we need to write the dissociation equation for magnesium acetate, so we'll draw the yield sign. And we're basically going to break the ions apart. Magnesium has a plus two charge. There's one magnesium and there are two acetate ions. And then I'm going to go ahead and write underneath each what information corresponds with them. So I'm trying to find the volume in milliliters of this if I have a 0 0.154 molar concentration of this and I end up with a solution that is 1.991 liters worth of a 0 0.0587 molar solution. So first you should note that you are given the volume and the molarity of the amount of acetate ion. So automatically you always want to take a concentration, molar concentration, and multiply it times its volume in order to get this amount in moles. So these two multiplied to each other gives us 0 0.1168 moles of acetate ions. Now that we're at moles, we can actually stoic from the acetate ion to the magnesium acetate. So I'll place 0 0.1168 moles of acetate times draw a line and we'll do a mole to mole ratio from the acetate to the moles of magnesium acetate and there is a two moles of acetate ions to one mole of magnesium acetate so when I take 0.1168 and I divide it by two I get 0. 0584 moles and that is of magnesium acetate. So now it's important to note that if we have the moles and we have the molarity then we can get the volume because moles divided by molarity is equal to the volume in liters. So I'll take these moles and I will divide by the molarity that was given to me here 0 0.154 molar and when I divide these two we get 0 0.379 liters but we want our answer to be in milliliters and so one liter equals a thousand milliliters when I multiply these I get 379 milliliters which corresponds with letter D.